Hi, this is Steven. Today we will be talking about pre-calculus, determinants of matrices. If you aren't familiar with the idea of matrices, matrices are just a rectangular array of numbers. Now, you may not know these numbers. That's not the point. It's just to show you. So I have pi square root 2, 5, 3, tau, to wow um what else phi squared e to the i pi um two square root Now this is a matrix. Don't worry if you don't know about pi or square root 2 or all these other numbers. This is just an example. Now, so we have a determinant of a matrix. What is the determinant of F? So now that we know what a matrix is, we can go ahead and take a stab at it. So what we first do is we, we rewrite it. So we put 4, 2, 0, minus 2. And so this is going to be equal to, so what we first do is we take the cross product of this, of this diagonal, so 4 times minus 2, and then take the cross product of this diagonal, My, and then we subtract that from 4 times minus 2, so 2 times 0. Okay, wait, so let me rewrite this. 4 times minus 2, this is this cross product, minus, and then we take this, 2 times 0. So now that we have our information, we could go ahead and dive in. So you might be stum stum stumbled when you look at this, but if, but if x times y and y is negative, then let's say that x times y is z, and it's just going to be minus z. So here we have 4 times minus 2. 4 times 2 is 8, and then 8, you just stick the negative, you get minus 8. And we should know this already. 2 times 0 is equal to 0. Now we subtract those, and we get is equal to minus 8. This is the second example. So we have the matrix A set to minus 1, 4, 4, 0. Now the question is, what is the determinant of A? So now that we know how to solve for the determinants, let's take a look at it. So we just rewrite it. Minus 1, 4, 4, 0. And then we take the cross product. Minus 1 times 0 minus... Now, we're getting to be pros. 4 times 4. 4 times 4. We already know how to solve this. Wait. This is crooked. Minus 1 times 0, and I put that in parentheses, minus 4 times 4. There. And we know how to solve this. This just, this just simplifies to 0. 
and then this simplifies to 16. So this is equal to 0 minus 16, which you can already tell by now, is equal to minus 16. So this is our answer. The term, the determinant of matrix A is equal to minus 16.